Hello everyone, this is Maria Figueroa again. Um, I just want to apologize in advance. I do have my kids at home with me, so it might be loud in the background. So I apologize for that. Um, I just wanted to go over how to do your citizenship grades this semester, taking into account that um, we're not supposed to give citizenship grades for the second semester final grade. So um, let's get to it. Uh, make sure you're on the gradebook tab. There's two ways. So the first way is through here, change the task to the high school citizenship. And then on here, it should have all your like current citizenship grades like saved. Um, and the way you're going to have to do this way is like a student by student basis. So you got to go through the drop down and just click on the blank. Um, for every single student. So this is kind of time consuming, um, but it's doable. Once you finish changing every single student's um, citizenship grade to blank, then you want to click save. Um, so once you finish, click save. And then it saves it for you. Um, and then you would go change it for every period. But again, that's kind of time consuming. So a faster way to do it is through the post grades tab. Um, and then under the post grades tab, again, make sure your task says high school citizenship. And then there's a way to just fill everyone's at the same time. So you're gonna go fill percent grade comment. And then on here, you're not doing a percentage. You're gonna click on grade. And then on this drop down, make sure you stay on, on the blank. You don't want to give them a citizenship, so you leave it blank. Make sure under students it says all. And then at the bottom, you just have to click fill. And then you get a confirmation page saying all students with active tasks will be updated continue. So just press OK. And then if you notice, it changed everybody's here, the drop down um, to a blank. And then the other way too, um, that you can do it is just manually on here do a citizenship so it would have been like whatever grade they had before and then just change it to blank so this is another place to do it but um, I wouldn't see anybody wanting to sit here and click on every single student so the other option again was to fill percent grade comment click on grade make sure this is blank um, and then students make sure that says all click fill and then confirmation, press OK, and it changes everybody's to blank. And then once you finish, make sure you click on save. And then you would go proceed the same with every section that you have. So, and then don't forget to do it for your TA as well. So just, and that's only one, so I just did it through there. Um, click on save and so forth. Um, so do it through every class period change everybody's citizenship to blank. Um, but that's pretty much it. Under the gradebook, you have to just do it one by one. I haven't found a way to do it simultaneously for every single student all at once. So I think the post grades option is going to be a much quicker option. Okay. Well, thank you. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget, if you ever have any questions, feel free to reach out to one of your tech reps.